Greetings, people of the internet. This is Cardiax, and today is a work in progress Wednesday, as well as a playing with wash video. I really enjoyed working on this cat, actually, because of the colors I used. Instead of mixing a new color every time that I wanted to get a variation, instead I used the pigments that I was already using and just added more color to that. I hope that makes sense. Anyway, I liked the idea of doing that, and it made the colors kind of stick together. Like, they they look like they fit instead of um, looking kind of too separate. Again, I hope that makes sense. Anyway, one of my cats, ironically, was a little bit of a butt. She wanted attention while I was working on this, so she crawled onto my arms, and then i you might see her paw pop up at some point, and I just kind of played with her claw until she ran away. Um, speaking of cats, the trouble I was having with my palette is hair. Freaking cat hair. Gets everywhere, and it gets, it gets in little dried paint in my palette a lot, so... I'm going to have to like keep a tweezer or something so I can pull it out. I'll probably also have to start changing my shirt when I start to paint because I have a tendency to forget to do so because whenever I whenever I paint it seems like the shirt kind of moves from my shirt onto the paint, onto the sketchbook, onto the everything so i'm like constantly trying to save my painting from the f the onslaught of fur so i need to start changing my shirt more often or at least lint roll it goodness gracious these cats are fluffy by the way this drawing i typically draw a head in this sketchbook and i'll just go back and add color whenever i feel like it and that's why that's why the sketches are typically done when I start doing gouache paintings. And this one wasn't really based on any cat. It was just me sketching a cat from memory. And I love it when they tuck their feet underneath themselves. So I decided I would look up a reference for a type of cat. And I ended up just looking for a forest cat. And I chose a cat with a tabby coat. Anyway, I hope you guys like this, and you know what to do. Bye!